I, I, this thing actually I have um, it cost me a lot because I never in my life I never step into the cells, but I slept in cells because of this matter. So it's a big lesson to me. I think the woman is what currently. I think the woman is. I bail her. The vehicle that was carrying the rosewood, one of the vehicle was is for my friend who is in Salga, called Babana. So he called me several times, begged me, and I've been with him for more than ten years. So this my friend called me and begged me to come and bail the woman. So I went. I came in. Build that is why I came in to build a woman. People are talking in town that the woman bribed me, the woman gave me money. The woman is still here, you can interview her. She never gave me one Ghana cities in my lifetime. <laughs> so, uh, how has been that for the struggling? I think it's my God who helped me through all the, uh, the business. It's God who helped me through all my way but i pray i always pray i don't sleep i always pray to my god to help me to get the woman but god being so good yesterday it was the day, the day before yesterday she called me that uh, she's on the way coming from uh, accra to tamale so when she arrived she called me and yesterday morning around seven she called me and said she arrived in Tamale, but she want to sleep by 10 she will call me to meet me with her lawyer so um around that time she couldn't i couldn't meet them i only met the lawyer then they assured me that uh, she will really appear the phone no say u twetwa pictures na na police officer na ba ho o him e phone free me sir o be him phone ni free me sir yeah hello mo chi me kwashe gadrun di sho it is to one all of us are hanko beto me sir ah yeah the hanko e gu won sir be ba cho an one boy be on his own over here, what to put his face. I didn't know she moved four to five hours. I'm doing a shame way. Central police station. Central police station. That's what I do. Uh, police officer all handle occasion. That's what I do. Who me a bundy? Mr. Anaba. Pure FM. And the onuna abo wa man ye se eh e china o mbe fro phone so no ma chira o court aye de o ko no there be one ka so be fro me chira o be to se chira me be report to me ho but court date ni de o mbe fro phone so na ka chira o but chira ni de yes be chira me ko court but e chira ni me report to police station i see was it one no na be ma o bill pa cho me regional organization and a eh i share so me vice chairman uh, Mr. Prof. Oh, okay, okay. And uh, he, uh, your friend said me, next deputy uh, thing uh, he could meet her. I see. Yeah. Okay. Mami now I say ano pe o vice chairman no e no be ba studio han ti o ba yani no be din koma but koso e ti yani lawyer bin so e din koma ano pe ni e bisa no se e e e e on from so e ti amra se ubi be ko be bi e ti san ubi chamfu ni ana. Medassi. I ran here no a day solar. Also called electoral commission as she and a baby a registration. No, or call her no, or could try a picture. Now, old chap picture, nana police for the city of Motes or can not summon at the train. Yeah, pet lawyer be na one my inch remove. Have you obey to my sister in Diana may country was equal, you say, or may police for no own chap pictures. Na ye yeah, mwe di ebesi. Ebi ya na eh, sola di ya na ye mfumu. Eh, ya di wasa yuko juu kan huwa. Mm. Na afi ya hun se di ya hun se mno eti. Eh, 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 mm. mm. Production room wanya. Ebi ti mi achimu. Mm. Kwa mwe ta yuchua pictures. Mm. Ti wuko, wuko public place na yuchua pictures. Eh, Asamo ya ato. All right. <laughs> lawyer, good morning. Good morning. Uh, lawyer, come here. I don't know if you know Eddie Cover up. Lawyer, you encounter no me. You have an arrangement too. Good morning, how? Mate, mate. But I don't pay. Uh, I don't pay. Yeah, yeah, pay education, Kakra. Yeah, ni a brand TV Kasa, also called Electoral Commission. I say, baby, yeah, yeah, limited registration exercise. 
na ninu anom a omo edi line mu eko ye registration no na o ye se o twa omo picture but also o twa picture na na police officer bi be hwim ni phone no e free ni nsem enu achi no omo de no ko share edan bi mi wo regional administration nye regional administration specific but area mu ho no omo de no ko share be bi kakra na omo de handcuff e gu ni nsa and then of course central police station or say um zoom the neck court wada roma obit me my own whether it's an offense or not to take a photograph in a public place could you the answer is no any offense there were you know there uh there's a saying or there's a an established legal principle I can say there's no property in spectacle. Meaning, say, which may show the photo, which means your hoi. The only uh, time, and I say, let me say this is in English before I can come and explain it. The only, the only option for the person you took the photo is an invasion of his privacy. That is the established principle. And it means that uh, what we know could all we know be a journalist, for example, and or in a human. Or take photos. There is no offense in the criminal code or anywhere in law that I can at this stage foresee. So what what committee that offense? The who offense is a branch of committee because uh, there is there is there is the right to individual to do their work. This guy could easily be a journalist. There is nothing stopping him from taking a photo. As long as the person whose photo was being taken could say it, and does not say, say you are invading his privacy. No. There's no law that I know of that anybody can say, say, Bema, we were bitchy, and as what causes any offense. Lawyer said, On your journalist, and so I obey to me a charm for your ass, Yes, it's the same thing. Who is a journalist anyway? Maybe in a way, I can tomorrow come and say, say, could you make money? I'm a journalist. I know for a fact that journalists are not supposed to be licensed. So I, as long as I can speak well, I can write well, I can I can be a photojournalist. There are people, journalists, who don't even write or speak. They are photojournalists. They can just take photos and do their work. There is no offense. I wish I could do all these things. I could say it in peace. But there is no offense that I know of that anybody, simply by taking photos, can be alleged to have committed any offense. I mean, who are you be a... Could you wait there just up one? I mean, who offense to be a... Not just a... Oh, oh, and on Tia Zemune Emremuno, and young from Soko and Biaso, Emrentia, or Queen Biaso, Sir Ubi, ever call a coachum for you, our baby, Empo, Sir, or how be the bar, maybe at the eight channel for you, they can say, you're evading the privacy. Thank you, thank you. Thank but what public know. place now we travel for India? There's, there's, there's no law. There's no law. Because you can, I can say, I'm frustrated. I don't want to be a lawyer anymore. I can be a home media work. Nobody can stop me from doing that. I can say, I'm frustrated. I don't want to be a lawyer anymore. I can be a home media work. Nobody can stop me from doing that. And I mean, who, baby, I'll give it to my case. I, uh, under the criminal code, I work on And I say, even with the common law, there's an offense committed by this, this guy. But as always, police is the only do before complaint. It was a bit by your charge in a crowd. All the court on what basis? Why are they? He would charge you. You have to charge the person first. Seek, uh, uh, what is it called? A fiat, so to speak, from the attorney general. Because you can't prosecute unless they give you a, a permission to prosecute. There's all these processes as much in the court. Only the court, why are they? I have no idea. It's very personal idea. Um, from the little I can see, or here from here, not here. And yes, you said, Bema, we and I say, a branch in our committee in your face. I see. Uh, you move on to another issue, and also Abba, uh, Supreme Court ruling Abba, sir, chief executives, sir, one a young one, Juma, now a bread and so, yeah, a buying an executive, no intimate, cassa. One for a German to honor one court. Emrano, Supreme Court ruling the buy and watching as a common eye be brave. If you say, Oh, any Omoa, a bay a ye one, 
obeti mi asan kwose wo kofa wa adwuma sana nchiremu no ete ruling no nti ase ene ne sen kojo eh obeti the starting point the bias is that if we say judgments are not retrospective unless the court expressly says so judgment bien wa e di ko achiri he said court ne ka se on a particular person like A, B, C, D, from day one, the appointment no, was void. Otherwise, it will always go forward, and it's always prospective. Now, in relation to Kwashi Abu Sabi, he said, by virtue of new government, you know, almost term of appointment was almost like automatically um, uh, dismissed, no. What then happened? I'm saying that is the question. The answer is very simple. Omo omo call for interpretation. Omo call se a general interpretation omo kusikiye. Then we omo call ena omo kase. Mr. A, Mr. B, Mr. C, Mr. D. They are twenty one. I know they were in office. Ena government is by and she are clear omo. And you will want the government, you want the, uh, sorry, the court to pronounce whether uh, they are so technically supposed to be in the job or they are no longer in the job. I don't know if we are following my. But That's what we follow, follow up, Good. Because you said all man call for a specific uh, 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 relief in relation to Mr. A, B, C, D. You know? It's more like a general statement, which can only be perspective. Let's look at it conversely. Assuming say, uh, court, uh, Mr. Sergio, when you're over the age of 60, no, no, I'm going to say, Supreme Court, you're going to say, you're going to say, you're CEO, when you public officer, and that's when you're public officer. So, who finally say you're public officer, they are second relief, second declaration, you can say, if it's not declared, say, so a public officer, yeah, and you will be away over 60. For example, say, John, I'm qualified to be a CEO because two release now, CK. Then the court will say, okay, first one, in relation to CEOs, no, you really need to say, CEOs are technically public officials or officers, and therefore, they should protect you. That means you've got your first relief. The court to then move on to the second one. Okay, in relation to Mr. Sejong, being a public officer, the law says you must be below 60 years. Is Mr. Sejong over 60 years? If the answer is yes, then the, the Supreme Court will say, okay, in that case, he no longer qualifies to be appointed as a CEO unless the court gives him, unless the, the government or the president gives him a special contract. I hope you're following my analysis. Me follow, pa. Aha. So, uh, in re- now I'm coming back to answering your question. Those who were automatically declared vacant, their position was automatically declared vacant, they did not go there to seek relief for the court to declare that by virtue of being declared vacant, it was unlawful. If they had done that, then the court would say, uh, in our view, you were not properly, the opposition was not properly declared vacant, and therefore you are entitled to your position. Other that, other than that, or failing that, then the judgment must be pro- prospective, not re- re- retrospective. I see. I hope you are following my analysis. Me, me follow analysis. Not just say, uh-huh. Emrano said the Supreme Court a canon. Eye, ye, kwa ye, ni mui. Se, abayi biya, eba. Obibia or ye juma as chief executives and a contract I the man on and so ya a bino intimin case unya in a juman to Hong Kong. And okay, so no no. Now, it means that my answer to that question, but you should ask me as a lawyer, what are some of the ramifications that could arise in light of this judgment? Bibisano. Me, me, ba, me, 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 <laughs> clarification be answer ye di sa anko mo. Okay. Uh, me kain se Professor Mills Bresso, there was an issue where Samu Kujetu, a court court on board. 
that boards no time no end so here and I'm buying so omo unko and the Supreme Court rule that as I say omo yama omo kwa eno omo ye omo ejima is it similar to this and I say because omo kwa ye on boards in inti no and I'm a chief executive there no na a year bit different uh because you want really a very good point I mean I'm a messy this was part of my analysis. You see, the, uh, the Supreme Court made two significant rulings. One in relation to the boards and one in relation to the CEOs. The Supreme Court say board members and more generally the board, they are not employees. And therefore, they no longer qualify or they don't qualify as public officers or public service officers. That's the two distinctions. They, they, they distinguish between a CEO and a board, which means the board in here almost immediately you serve with and at the pleasure of the president. As soon as the president is going, all of you are going. But the CEO doesn't go. That's the difference between the two rulings, all in one judgment. So in, so in that, some Okuja to Matano, how, how do we... It means... It means the Supreme Court has now departed from its earlier decision, which it is entitled to. It's the only Supreme Court. The Supreme Court is the only court having been departed from its own decision. All other courts below the Supreme Court have to follow what the Supreme Court says. And it's not, the Supreme Court may unintentionally revisit the same situation, and they will come up with something um, different. That in itself means the older view is no longer good law. Yes, and this is my my two as here. Now, just a ruling a bar and a a cancer will be your chief executive and a term of office and soon, yeah, even if there is a change of government, on Koswan Yenejuma, but it will be a board member immediately. There is a change of government, Nejuma, no, with your president, Abbey. That's right, okay, all right. So, moving on with the ruling, you know, implications at the same, okay, this is. Where I have my head was spinning as soon as I saw it, and I went and quickly got a copy and started reading it. It means to say, on December 6th, on December 7th, when we go to vote, and the president of whatever party is in power loses, he still remains the president until January 7th. The question therefore arises is the Supreme Court has now nullified or, or, or avoided certain sections of the Presidential Transition Act, which was previously saying, blanketly, you all serve at the, pre pre uh, uh, at the pleasure of the President, and when you go, all your CEOs and everything goes away. The Supreme Court say it's void, because it's inconsistent with the protection given to public officers. Now, this therefore means Parliament now needs to revisit the Presidential Transition Act. Yeah. To make provisions, because somebody who has lost an election on December 6th or 7th still remains the president until January 7th. He is entitled to make whatever appointment. So we may have a situation where if I am the president, call me the former mayor president, but lose elections, I will quickly appoint CEOs in various places and give them terms of employment. Which means, come January 7th, oh, come, uh, you, Mafu. you are the new president. You cannot do anything about the CEOs and giving them terms of, um, uh, of, of employment.